Good evening. How is everybody doing? Thank you so much for tuning into my channel. Welcome to Ella Wolf Station. And today we're going to talk about some goodies on the channel. Y'all know how it go. Um, I want to thank you all, first and foremost, for tuning in, for giving me the opportunity to actually speak with you. Um, today's topic is going to be about the first five. And in many of our cases, it may be your first handful, whether that's 10, 20, however many people that you may have started off and signed up. Um, so let's go ahead and jump right into it. I ain't going to try to take up too much of your time. Um, so with carrot bars, you want to, you know, you want to understand why you're doing this. Why are you saving gold? Why are you starting a business? And you want to be clear and concise when you're thinking about why you're doing the business. Um, you need to know these things so that you'll never quit. So if you have a family, you're doing it for your family. If you're doing it because you want to travel or if you're doing it because you just want financial freedom um, or, you know, you just want money. Like it, it is what it is. We all have our different ventures that we want to do, whether you want to be an artist, um, you know, own your own business, things of that nature. So write down all of these goals. I want you to write down all of your goals. Like, I don't care what it is. I want you to write down your goals and carrot bars and your goals in life because you're going to need, this is going to be crucial to your learning process and crucial to creating new pictures within your day-to-day -day life so that they actually start to come to fruition. So as we all know in life, when you want something, you do what? You go out and you get it. You don't wait for nobody to do anything for you. I mean, maybe you have a partner or something. Some of y'all may ask your significant other, your mom, your dad, your aunts, your uncles, maybe if they could pick something up for you. But as far as like the things that you want for your life, your household, your family, what do you do? You got to go out and you got to get it. So let's be clear on that goal. Don't let anything stop you. It's up to you not to let anybody take your focus. Don't let anybody talk you out of this. Don't let, don't get scared. Don't talk your own self out of it. Be be positive in the things that you are doing within this business. And also you saving gold, that's going to better your future. Like you got to be positive in this in every single way. You have to build your endurance. You got to stay motivated and you have to attend meetings and you have to keep a positive mindset. And when I say attend meetings, if you don't even have time to attend meetings, tune into my channel every day. Every day I'm going to start trying to upload a new video and I'm going to try to start talking about different things. So I'm going to start teaching y'all different things day by day. So again, build your endurance, be positive. Stay focused because you are like in life, you get out of it what you put into it. So I want y'all to remember that you're going to get out of this business what you put into it. So stay focused. If you really want to be a millionaire, pay attention to these videos. Pay attention to other Care Bars members that are actually making a bunch of money. Like they are going to show you how to get to it just like they have shown me how to get to it. So I want y'all to keep that in mind. Keep positive. Build your endurance. Let's go. All right, y'all. So I want you to think of you starting this business within carrot bars or you saving gold within carrot bars as a basketball game, as a football game. I want you to think of it as like a hand of blackjack, poker, spades, things of that nature. Because what happens, like you start a game, you won't want to finish that. You want to see the rest of that basketball game. You want to see the rest of that football game. Like what's the score going to be? What's the plays going to be within there? And that's how I feel about this. Like my heart is like this every day. Like what's the next play? What's going on? What am I doing? Who am I talking to today? Because I'm excited. I'm super excited about this business. So I don't want y'all to quit. I want you to keep in mind that follow through on what you're doing because again what you put into this business you're going to get out of it and i find a lot of times in life that people will give up they will give up on their own selves as far as a business before they quit their own job and that's not cool like y'all gotta be y'all gotta treat yourself just as good as y'all treat these jobs like go all in like go all in this is future this is financial freedom like don't quit. And I also want y'all to be nice to yourselves. Like, just remember to be nice to yourself because what happened when you started school? Elementary, middle school, high school, you started basketball, you did karate, you did things of that nature. Like, you made sure that you gave yourself time to learn. Like, you may have failed a few times, but what happened? You gained more information along the way. So don't quit on yourself. Like, allow yourself to learn the business. Allow yourself... A week or two and if you're just as excited as I am you'll learn it within a week you'll learn it within a couple of days because you're going to see what 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 the outcome is actually going to be like you're going to see the bigger picture more a lot faster than other people so keep your endurance and don't quit like don't give up on yourself all right y'all so 
also within this business, you know, of carrot bars, what you're going to receive from a lot of people trying to discourage you. And again, build your endurance. Don't let nobody knock you off your high horse because this is a definite guarantee. Like we, we about to get to it. Like, let's go. All right. So I don't want y'all to let nobody knock you off your high horse, but you will get questions like, Oh, are y'all a pyramid scheme? Are you a multi-level, you know, what, what are you? Like, I ain't trying to invest my money just so you could take it and get paid out on. Like, listen, I'm not taking none of your money. We're saving gold. We're saving in gold to secure our financial future. And by everybody saving in gold, we are all receiving compensation off of one another. They have a, Care Bars has a crazy compensation program. So I need y'all to remember that. Look into your back office. And for those of y'all that have not signed up yet, you're going to be looking into your back office soon after this call. I guarantee you. All right. So again, you're going to get a few, you know, questions like, are you a pyramid scheme? And to answer your question, no, we're not. We are a multi-level marketing company. We are an ECC commerce company. We operate as ECC. And I need y'all to look into that. I need, I want y'all to also do your own research on this as well, because you need to learn. You need to, your brain needs to see that. You need to hear it. Like you, you got to start doing some of the research yourself as well. So when people are asking you stuff and I want, I just want to read four things for you guys. And this is directly from the IRS. And if you don't believe me, go to the IRS website and look it up yourself on a multi-level marketing company versus a pyramid scheme. So types of direct selling companies. There are two types of direct selling companies. Single level multi-marketing or multi-level marketing. Single level marketing companies reward direct sellers for their own personal sales activity. Single level marketing direct sellers cannot take on other distributors or sales representatives. Income comes from commissions or bonus on sales versus in a multi-level marketing company, sales representatives are able to sponsor other distributors or sales rep representatives and receive a commission or bonus on the sales made by their underlying resellers. This recruitment of downliners is necessary to increase a sales representative's sales force and thus generate a greater number of sales. Multi-level marketing um Companies are often referred, referred to as network marketing companies. All right. Um, also, multi-level marketing differs from an activity called a pyramid scheme. Pyramid schemes are illegal. Scams in which large number of people at the bottom of the pyramid pay money to a few people at the top. The success of a pyramid scheme relies upon a never-ending supply of new participants. Never-ending. It's going to be one day where this is a cap. Like... We're in our ICO phase, so I need y'all to remember that. It's going to be a moment when it's a cap, but listen to this. Listen, two more things for me. Just listen in. And again, remember, this is directly from the IRS. Pyramid schemes seek to make, mo um, make money quickly. Multi-level marketing companies seek to make money with their representatives as their business grows by selling their consumer products. Multi-level marketing companies have a startup fee that is small, with a starting sales kit being sold at or below the company's cost. Multi-level marketing depends upon sales to the consumer and establishing a market. One more thing. <laughs> Why are Americans so interested in becoming direct sellers? Most are independent contractors. And I'm an independent contractor right now as a server. Y'all got to remember that. Like, it's many... It's many MLMs out here. Like, y'all got to remember that a lot of us work for them and you're working in shoe stores in New York, things like that, when you're getting commission and bonuses off of that. All right. So why are Americans so interested in becoming direct sellers? Most are independent contractors. They have the ability to work part time or full time and can choose when and how many hours they want to devote to their business. In other words, an individual can earn in proportion to their efforts. So remember, I told you, you want to get out of this business, what you put into it. The level of success is limited only by their willingness to work hard and a person can own their own business with very little or no capital investment. Since direct sellers do not need any specific amount of education, knowledge, or any specific requirement in order to be successful, they only need the desire and self-motivation to grow their own their business and make it profitable for them. So again, y'all, what did I just talk about in the last slide? Building your endurance. Don't let nobody quit make you quit don't let nobody talk you out of this and also what you put into this you're going to get out so just remember that like this is big y'all this is bigger than you can ever imagine and i really want y'all to tap into this and i really want you to listen to this and engage 
All right, y'all. So we just spoke about MLMs and pyramid schemes. And also, this is something that, you know, that you can also say to people that are asking you this. Like, in a sense, we've all, we all worked for pyramid schemes before. Walmart, Bank of America, restaurants, uh, CVS, Rite Aid, uh, Pepsi, Coca-Cola, a bunch of different things. Like, anywhere that you're working at and pretty much where you're working at right now, you're working for a pyramid scheme. Keep that in mind. And with this slide that we have on the screen, look at it. Just like it says, we know what people are thinking. That looks like one of those pyramid scheme things. But what happens at the companies that you're working at right now, there's a CEO at the top of this company. It's a CEO at the top of this company. What's that CEO doing? He's making all the money. He's profiting without having to do nothing. Kick back, laid back, chilling like a mug, okay? So the CEO is making a lot of money. Say that's roughly $22 million as we have on this slide. We're going to use these numbers here. Say that's $22 million. What does he do? He then hires a CFO, which is a chief financial officer and a vice president. And what are they doing? They making $10 million and they're overseeing the regional team manager and the regional sales manager. But what happens with those two? They ain't got no life, y'all. They have no life. Because what? What is they doing? They're at the company from nine to nine sometimes or nine to five because they're overseeing supervisors. They're making sure the supervisors are interned to them and making sure that that team is doing the right thing. So what are those supervisors doing? They making eighty to hundred thousand dollars. Yeah, they making okay money. They making good money compared to the rest of us. We're not making that. Most of us is making anywhere from twenty five thousand to fifty thousand a year if you got two jobs or you know working extra hard like. But where are we at on a, at this scale? We're on the bottom of this pyramid and we're making crumbs. We're making crumbs on the dollar for the services that we're selling to people, for the customer service that we're providing to people, for the sales directly that we're providing to people. Like I know when I worked uh, at B of A, like, and I don't own no rights. I'm not talking bad about them. I'm just talking about my personal experience. Sorry, I wanted to throw that in there, y'all. But I know when I worked there, like, I got tired of working in a cubicle. Yeah, I was making a pretty good money, like maybe $40,000 a year. And what my bonuses and things of that nature for making sure that I closed cases or found fraud, things of that nature. But I was tired of doing that. You know how many hours I had to be there? Eight hours out of the day. I was tired of doing that. So what is the point of this, y'all? Like, do you want to work until you die? Or do you want to put into this business what you can get out of it? I, like... Like, I've been doing this for a couple weeks now. Like, I'm getting a lot out of it. And I know I'm going to get a lot out of it, especially come December. Like, I'm ready. And I'm going to keep hitting the ground running every day. I'm going to keep talking to people. Now, stop, you know, I'm just going to keep hitting the ground running. I want y'all to do the same thing. So the question is, how much longer are you going to be at the bottom of someone's pyramid looking at people at the top make all the money? Don't y'all want to be one of those people at the top of your own business? Like, let's go. Like, you can make as much money or as little money as you want in this business just by saving gold for yourself. So I want you to remember that. All right. So the first week for some of y'all, I know it's going to be nerve-wracking because you got all this excitement. You probably like this. You know how when you be at a basketball or football game at the top of the Raptors? Because a lot of us can't feel, afford those floor seats. I ain't going to lie. I can't afford it. When I go to Beyonce's concert, I'm at the top with the other people. But you know what's happening at the top of the Raptors? This is what your first week is going to feel like. It's going to feel like a roller coaster ride, but you're going to be pumped for the people that's pumped inside and the people that's ready. Like, you're going to get to it. Like, you're going to get other people just as motivated as you are. They're going to be like, dang, like, he, she's super excited. Like, what's going on? Like, let me actually, you know, let me take a listen in on that. And that's where I'm at with it right now. So the first week, I want y'all to hit the ground running. And when I say hit the ground running, like, even if this is your first phone call, your first webinar, um, your first meeting with me, like hit the ground running. And when I say that, like for myself, I hit the ground running this past week. And you know, I made, I made a couple, I made a couple failures in my first week. Like I, I was just, I was so excited. Like I, I, I'm talking about money and gold and care bars and what they can do for people. And people are just like, whoa, 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 whoa. It's too much information. So you know what? I had to retail her that. And we're going to talk about that in a couple more minutes, but hit the ground running. It's okay to make mistakes. 
it's okay. Some of y'all are still, y'all are rocking with me. A lot of y'all are rocking with me and you're bringing more people onto these phone calls than we could ever have imagined. And I really, really appreciate that. So again, y'all seen me when I had to slow down on my first week with some of y'all for my first, my first uh, handful of team members. So it's nothing wrong with having to go back, having to relearn, having to do a bunch of things, but hit the ground running. Definitely. Um, the next thing is going to be focus for your first 30 days. You're going to benefit from this. Your family's going to benefit from this. Like focus, suck up as much information as you can. Watch this video over. Like if you felt like you ain't see something, rewind that last second that I just said. Watch this video over. Like get the information out of these videos that you absolutely need because it's going to help you be financially free and financially independent of any job ever again. Unless you really have a hobby or something that you want to do, like you're going to be financially free. So again, focus for your first 30 days. Um, you want to also position yourself, put five new people on, on this phone call, on this group chat, on, on anything with us, get them to talk to me. I'm ready to talk to people, send them to me so I can help you get people on your team. Like I'm ready, like, let's go. So you want to position yourself with five new people every week on these, on these webinars. And the next thing you want to do is you want to set up your own uh, PGR, your private goal reception, set up your own private goal reception, whether it be on the web, whether it be on a chat, whether it be on a call, phone call, you have everybody mute their phones, like whether it's a FaceTime, Instagram video chat, like that's how I started out my, my first couple weeks. Like I'm on Instagram video chat and like, I'm getting to it because I'm serious about my business. Like I see, I see the, the, the end goal, not even the end goal. I see the, the long, the, the bigger picture out of everything. Like I see that Hail Mary, baby, and I'm going to catch that ball. Bing! Like, I'm trying to let y'all know. All right. So, and also remember that amateurs, what? They can start a business. Just like I said with the football game, the the, the, the poker game. Like, you might got something or spades. You got somebody cutting over cards and you like, nah, like, get that man out of here. Get that girl out of here. Like, let's who, who can really play? Like, let's go. Like, so you might quit the Nah, see it through. Teach that person how to play. Like. Don't be an amateur because what? Professionals are going to launch a business and you're going to be that professional within the game that's going to say, nah, we ain't going to cut this game short. We're going to teach this person how to properly pay spades and how to stop cutting over people and how to stop dishing out numbers. And I still don't know how to pay spades. I, I'm, I'm that person that cuts over people. <laughs> like, keep that in mind. Don't make me a spade partner unless you're willing to teach me. But I'm going to learn. I'm going to learn. I'm going to definitely get back in there and I'm going to learn. My girl really trying to teach me. Um, on another note, Commit to saving two grams of gold in your first month. Again, what did I say to you guys? You're saving gold for yourself, for your family, if you have a family or for whoever you want to save it for, because you're going to provide yourself what? Financial freedom. Like, just look at the bigger picture, y'all. Get to saving your gold because it's only going to benefit you. Um, and if you build it, people are going to keep coming. People are going to come. They're going to want to know what you're doing. And, hey, I ain't seen you in a couple weeks and work. What happened? What happened to you? Like you good? Like, yeah, I'm actually amazing, and I actually own my own business, and I'm doing really, really well. I can actually teach you how to do it. Like again, talk to people. They gonna be. They see how excited you are. They're gonna jump on this opportunity. Um, and again, what did I talk about in the first couple minutes? Write down your goals, your dreams, and life and carrot bars, and review them. I want you to review them twice a day, maybe three times a day. I don't know how excited you are, but me and my girl, my mom, my little sister, my brother, we have vision boards because what? We are creating new pictures for our future. Again, if you've ever read like the Four Agreements, uh, The Secret, you listen to motivational speakers, like different things of that nature, you will understand that the power of your mind is the 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 intentions of your mind are really powerful and what you see as a picture every day you create that for yourself what you hear for yourself you hear that like we read ours out loud not next to each other but i go and i read mine out loud all my goals even if it's 50 of them i don't care if you got 50 you got 100 write them down read them twice a day read them when you wake up read them when you go to bed and make sure that you can hear yourself because this is real like you're going to create a new world around yourself and you're going to be so surprised so make that vision board of the car you want the vacation you want to go on the the knowledge that you want to possess the clubs you may want to go to the clothes you want to buy the babies you want to have the nursing homes you want to pay for anything i'm just it can be anything write them down 
repeat them to yourself twice a day, three times a day. Make a vision board so that you can see what's going on too. Like because you're going to start to see all the, the bigger picture. You're going to start to see all of that coming together. And I'm gonna be so happy for all of y'all when y'all get y'all financial freedom and get to make your goal, your dreams come true. Okay, so we want to talk about the benefits for and of the first five people. Um, with that being said, you will position yourself to earn a thousand dollars a week just by helping other people save in gold. You want to help them help other people learn how to save in gold. They're going to learn for themselves how to save in gold. And even if you just want to save, whether as a customer or as an affiliate, like, because I know I probably have a mixture of both right now. Like, oh, maybe I'm not about to get into the business. I just want to save gold to secure my future. And, you know, I know the price of gold rises and the dollar deflates, um, you know, from year to year, time to time, things of that nature. So whatever you want to do, you're going to position yourself to, um, you're going to position yourself to be able to, save in gold um you know as well as help other people because the company is going to pay you out six percent just for people underneath of you purchasing gold so just keep that in mind like you're you're all benefiting from one another no i don't need you to buy gold underneath of me i want you to buy it for you because i'm buying it for me i'm not thinking about the person over top of me because the in in a sense i'm not like i don't want to sense I don't want to say that that way, but I'm not thinking of them in the sense of the money that they're receiving off of me because the gold is benefiting me is going to benefit me and my future and my family as well. So you got to think about it in that way. But I am worried about the people above me because those are my peers. Those are the experts above me. Those are the people that are teaching us that have mastered the business way before us and are going to teach us how to get to it as well. So, you know, keep that in mind, like follow Crypto Steve, follow um, Derek Brown, follow, it's a couple other people that I can name, but you know, those are a few of my top ones that I like to watch because they are passionate and they can show you some things like their videos are awesome. Some of their videos are where I get my clips from or where I get my motivation. And I even go to Derek Brown's um, conference meetings or, you know, when we have um, Carrot Bar's informational sessions when we're bringing new people because, man, that guy can talk and he is good at what he does. So, Mr. Brown, if you're watching my video, I just want to say thank you. I really do appreciate you for inspiring me, for inspiring my mom. Um we following you, bro. We definitely behind you, and uh, hopefully we catching up to you soon. <laughs> All right. So, um, again, the benefits of and for your first five is going to allow you to upgrade for free. So, whatever package that you sign up for, like when I first started out, I signed up for the bronze. Now, when you sign up for the bronze package, you have five weeks. I'm telling you, you have five weeks to go ahead and sign five people up under the same package or another package. When you sign five people up for the same package that you have or higher, the company is gonna upgrade you to the next level for free. I'm gonna repeat that, some of y'all not hearing that. The company is gonna upgrade you to the next level for free. And the higher level of packages that you obtain, you're gonna get higher payouts from your dual team systems that go down and down in your uni levels. We'll talk about that in another video, but. Just keep in mind that the company is going to upgrade you for free. So when they upgrade you for free to that next package, you have an additional five weeks from that date that they update you, up, upgrade you, excuse me, to go ahead and upgrade another five people to the silver package because that's the next package and so on and so forth. Like you want and you're going to teach them how to, to upgrade their people to the next package. Like they're going to start this. The more that they watch you, the more that you talk to your group, the more that you interact with your group, stay active with them because you don't want to let, you know, nobody get discouraged. You want to see people be either on the same level as you or even above you, like supersede me, like go, 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 go to Kentucky Derby, man, run that track. Like, let's go. Like y'all can do this and I know you can do it. So again, the company will upgrade you for free and it gives you five additional weeks to go ahead. So that can be one person a week. You can sign maybe more than one person up a week. I know y'all can do it, um, but it's going to be a good thing. And in addition to that, when you're signing people up and you're upgrading the packages, the company is going to give you free KCB coins. So they'll directly deposit those into your account. And it's not a matter of if, it's a matter of when, like when you sign somebody up, the system is looking for a bing, bing, bing. Who, who, who am I paying out next? Where am I putting KCB coins at now? How do you want this? You want this in gold or you want this in cash? You want this gold delivered to you? You want this store? Like they are here for us. Like 
they're here for us. Like Harold is the man and thank you Harold above anything else for providing gold to us at uh uh you know smaller level that we can actually afford it in smaller increments rather than having to purchase a kilo of gold for fifty thousand dollars because I know I don't have fifty thousand dollars right now to just go purchase a kilo of gold to ensure my future like so I'm thankful for this opportunity. I'm really thankful for this opportunity and I hope that y'all see the value in this as well gonna be a few things that kill your business that's gonna stop you you not you you might hit your ceiling things of that nature but don't hit no ceiling like I said and build your endurance don't procrastinate don't make excuses because they like buttholes what everybody got one wah, 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 wah. so again don't make excuses don't neglect your business you should be spending at least 35 to 45 minutes at the most every day at the at the excuse me at the minimum every day on your business like talking to people talking to at least one you know one, one to five people every day even if it's one that's 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 good like just don't neglect your business and don't neglect yourself because what what does it take to run a business you got to put your focus into it like how do you think these other companies and these other amazon ebay all of them like walmart how do you think they got kfc all of them how do you think they got where they at like focus staying focused on what they want to do and seeing the vision that they have put in their minds and they bringing it to fruition and putting it in the real world so also another thing that'll kill your business is non-communication like y'all don't be scared to ask me no questions please like ask me every single question that you have like i feel still feel like sometimes i'm asking dumb questions but i don't care like i need to know my information and i'm excited about this like talk to whoever you want to you can even call uh carrot bars we have a hotline we have an email if you don't want to talk to anybody live like they want to answer all your questions like talk to them even if you're signing up a business under the k merchant system like talk to them like if you can't explain nothing for a business but somebody sees how excited you are as one of your friends like yeah here's a number like call carrot bars like talk to them and then get back to me after you talk to them because you know what they're going to let them know everything they need to know about that system like stop playing like they are here for us completely um also another thing that's going to kill your business is not being plugged into the digital groups webinars video chats uh my phone number my instagram um my my youtube where we're going to be posting these videos like get plugged in like i'm telling y'all get plugged in get signed up like let's do this like i'm ready to make a bunch of uh, a bunch of uh financially free independent millionaires and carrot bars is like they're guaranteeing that they're going to make over 24 million millionaires come december the 15th so like i need y'all to understand like what the future is holding for a lot of us like you got to really look into this opportunity look into your back office for those of y'all that are again new potential um, prospects of joining the business and joining either one of our teams like do some research talk to us like we we ready to we ready to help you hit the ground running and ready to help you start saving financially for your future and putting yourself in in place to to be okay so again don't kill your business don't kill your business those are the couple things that's going to do it for you so make sure y'all keep y'all endurance keep positive stay focused all right in y'all second week what i want y'all to do is to focus on the people that you initially brought in on the first week, helping them, making sure that they're getting five people um, or they're getting new people on a call, even if it's one new person. Like, just make sure that they're getting somebody on this call. Somebody else got to be as excited as you. Like, you can't tell me. Like, think about some food. What, 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 what's the dang one sandwiches that came out the KFC? Y'all was going crazy over them chicken sandwiches. What? They ain't even got them no more, but they about to come back out with them in a little bit. And this is 2019 for yo, those of y'all, like, if this video, you know, when it gets older. So, like, y'all went crazy over those uh, KFC joints or the, the, no, the Popeyes. My bad. When Popeyes had the, had the biscuits and stuff and the, and the chicken and whatnot, y'all went crazy over that. Like, be excited. Get somebody else just as excited. Like, just like you can get excited over the next phone that's coming out. Like, you talking to people and they're getting excited because the phone companies is talking about it. Like, Get excited, y'all. Get excited for your business, and you're definitely going to make help a lot of people come along. Um, so get them on the phone calls. Get them on the webinars. Um, get them on the group chats. You know, get them in the group chats with your peer mentors that they have created. And, um, you know, go out to the conference meetings if you have time once a week because we have them. Some some leaders that are a little higher up, like Miss um, Kim uh, in Delaware, she has meetings maybe multiple times out the week maybe at once every day or every other day so like 
if you're in Delaware, go ahead and look up those meetings and they're near the Christiana um, Center. So you want to look into that. Also, keep the momentum going. Show your team you're passionate and you're persistent. And I'm passionate. I'm persistent. Like, I'm going to talk to y'all. Like, some of my team members is a little quiet, but I'll hit them in a one-off. Hey, what's going on? Like, you need a, you need help with any parts of the business? Like, you having trouble understanding anything? Like, you need me to walk you through something? Like, I'm here for y'all. And I'm going to ask y'all questions because I, I ain't signed. I didn't ask you to sign up the help create a business or help save money to for y'all not to be doing nothing like i know what's happening in this business and i want y'all to see the value in it too so i'm gonna contact you i'm gonna stand on your back about different things also i want you to practice your speeches like you see me looking down here and there you know things of that nature and i am looking at my my outline because i want to make sure that i'm hitting all the points and that i don't forget anything so you want to make your speeches as genuine as possible and practice them so that they'll come out a lot more fluidly and those points that you want to talk on they'll rolling out your mouth just like that you know when you be at Chuck E. cheese and all the tickets be rolling out you know you be playing the kids games y'all ain't supposed to be playing the kids games like come on y'all be taking the tickets it's okay though because i know y'all want the candy and the games too. get the kid whether for you or for your children so <laughs> it is what it is but um also, again, I want y'all to make another list for me tonight, please. Um, even if you're a new a new potential person, I know you're getting excited on this call. Like, oh, I could talk to this person. I could talk to that person. Remember them people. Write them down. Try to write down 100 and 150 people. You may think this sounds idiotic, but come on, man. Y'all y'all can claim y'all ain't got no friends. Y'all ain't y'all don't talk to this many people. But if I'm guaranteed, if I say, hey, can I look at your phone real quick? Can you pull your phone book up? Y'all got more than 100 contacts in your phone. I don't care. Like... Hit some people up, contact some people, talk to your family members, talk to your friends, like talk to people that are close to you because you know the people that's close to you gonna believe what you're talking about, especially if you're passionate about it and you're not you're not uh messing around. Sorry, I wanna use proper terminology. Um also make time to commit to your business, to work on your business. Thirty five to forty five minutes a day is not a long time. Like my office right now is my closet. I'm not gonna lie about it. I'm in my closet, but you can go in your basement, you can go in your car, you can lock yourself in your room, um, you can go in the laundry room, but make time to yourself so that you can call a couple people a day or text a few people or send some emails or, you know, get on a phone call yourself to, to listen to different things. Like get excited about it. Make sure that y'all are staying on top of things. And, and again, make that time to commit to your business because again, you're going to get out of this what you put into it. Um, and when you call people, see who's making decisions. Don't overwhelm them with carrot bars and uh, cryptocurrency, saving gold, all the money that they can make because it's a lot. Like, oh, like if somebody like, and I did that to people in my first week, y'all, and I'm not going to lie. Like, I'm going to go back and I'm going to try to talk to some people that I didn't overwhelm too much and that are willing to, you know, still listen to me. Like, but I know I did that to some people and I want to help y'all to to not do that to folks like again so i want you to see who's making decisions and by that collect their decisions and what and that means that you're asking questions to see who qualifies like all right if they're not interested in the business hey you interested in making extra money extra cash no nah, i'm good i don't want to do that all right cool like i'm not pressing nobody to do nothing if y'all are moving on y'all are moving on like i'm not pressuring nobody to do nothing will i talk to you about it yeah, but will you also be a little bit salty in a few months when you see a bunch of us in Madrid partying up? All the people that I signed up that didn't say nothing, we all out Madrid partying. We out to buy for my birthday. Like, I'm ready to take the team. Like, like let's go, y'all. I'm trying to go up, up, and more up. Like, and that's the only place that you can go in Carrot Bars, whether you're saving gold for yourself and you're not a part of the business side or whether you're on the business side, like, I just think it would be silly to not join the business side. Like for uh, an investment of two hundred, almost two hundred dollars, as little as two hundred dollars, and it's tax deductible. Tax season coming up, y'all. Y'all can write that off. This is a business. I want y'all to remember we are an ECC commerce company. We are not a pyramid scheme. So keep it in mind. Okay. All right. So I want to give you all a few examples. Um, on contact on contacting your prospects like potential people that you want to sign up for this business that you know will have an amazing time like doing amazing things within the business like talk to people you know you have those those prospects like talk to them so i'm going to give you a few talking points and then we're going to end the video after this so just give me like three more minutes y'all and i'll have y'all out of here in a couple minutes um 
So you start off with, did I catch you at a bad time? And always start with that because you never know what people got going on in their lives. We all have personal lives. Somebody might be at a doctor's appointment. Somebody might be, uh, you know, at their kid's soccer game, basketball game. Somebody might be cooking dinner, holding a baby, and talking to you, trying to talk. Like, come on, it's an inconvenience. So don't be rude, y'all. Make sure you ask people, hey, did I catch you at a bad time? And when you get them and they say, hey, oh, no, what's up? I could talk to you. Don't don't talk about small talk because it's going to throw you off track. Go straight into what it is that you want to talk about. So again, did I catch you at a bad time? No, no, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I got a quick question for you. If I can show you a way to earn some serious additional income without interfering with what you got going on now, would you be open to watching a short video or jumping on a phone call with me tonight? And some people are going to be like, mm, Laura or Ella, what you talking about? Like, And I'm going to be like, listen, I don't want to mess it up. I want to give it, I want you to get it. The same way that I got it from experts who can give us all the details. So can you just do me a huge favor and jump on the phone call tonight? And they're going to say, yeah, sure, because you're not being rude about it. You're not being persistent. Like, I mean, you being, you know, a little persistent, but in a nice way, like asking a question in a different way. Like, so they're going to be like, yeah, sure. After that, say, OK, I'll see you tonight. Um, I'll send you the information or I'll send you an email or I'll send you a message on social media. Like, and then just jump off the phone. All right. I'll talk to you later. Boom. All right. One more. Um, two more examples. If I can show you how to say And again, did I catch you at a bad time? <laughs> and if they say, nah, go ahead. If I can show you how to save money doing what you're doing now, would it be worth five to 10 minutes of your time? And most people are going to say, yeah. Another way. Hey, I got a serious question for you. If you had a chance to get the two most important things in life that you want or that you ever dreamed about, what would it be? And sit back and listen. I want to buy a boat. I want to go to uh, Istanbul. I want to go to Tokyo. I want to buy a mansion and go swim with dolphins and different things of that nature. Whatever your dream is, listen to them. So once they stop talking, say, if I can show you a unique opportunity that has a unique product in an untapped market globally and has insane compensation program, you get all the support, all the mentorship to build your business and your total investment is as little as $200 and it's tax deductible, would it be worth it to you? Would it be worth your time to listen to a, a few things or watch a short video? Just shut up and listen. See what they say. They're going to be like, oh man, like really? All of that? Like, you know, I'm not really too sure, but yeah, let me go ahead and let me let, send that video to me. Let me, let me see what's going on within that thing. So again, these are simple questions that you can ask people without mentioning a bunch of uh, carrot bars jargon. And by that, I mean like business terminology within carrot bars that people don't really understand that are you are just trying to talk to and get them interested. Like, again, don't overwhelm people. Those few simple questions, they go a long way. And don't use the same one on every single person. Switch it up sometimes. Depending on who you're talking to, you know how you got to come at them, how you got to speak to them. If you can just make a quick, ah, 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 boom, bam, bam. Like, so... Again, learn to find out if people are open to being able to make decisions. And before you start talking to them about all the crypto, the gold, the carrot bars, like when you do this with your first couple of people, like your first handful of people, you're going to start to receive the reactions that you're looking for. And again, y'all, this is Ella Wolf. I want to say thank you so much for tuning in. If, uh, if you are on my team and you have any questions, please contact me right away. If you are not on my team and you are just seeing this video randomly, please contact me. My information is going to be below. And also, if you are new prospects, please get back to whoever um, whoever told you to watch this video because you want to make sure that you go ahead and sign up with them. You don't want to miss a moment. Every moment that you're not signing up is money that you're missing for your family, yourself, or within the business. Like You're leaving money on the table, and it's a it's it's a lot of money to be made. I'm just letting y'all know that. So again, I'll catch y'all later on the next video. It's Ella Wolf. I'll catch you later. Have a great evening. Have a great day.